Cones, welcome back to another stylicious and delicious cake and candy episode. This peppermint candy cake pop tutorial proves that you don't need a lot of equipment for decorating, just a round cookie cutter, some wafers for dipping, and some colors, and your peppermint candy pop are ready to roll. So here we go. As usual, I start with an already crumbled and mixed cake pop dough. If you want to learn about the mix that makes shaping, dipping and decorating super easy, have a look in the info box at the top right corner. I rolled out a layer which is around half of an inch thick and used a circle cookie cutter which is one and a half inch wide. And then I gently used my fingers to push out the dough from the cookie cutter and then I softened the edge a little bit. Next I did the dipping. That means I put the stick into the candy melts for about a couple of centimeters and then place the stick in the middle of the candy. First, that cake pop needs a complete coating. That's why I dip it all the way in white candy coating. And by the way, if you like that kind of videos, make sure to subscribe to my channel. You can also follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Pinterest. And if you want, I share my videos with the rest of Candyland. Make sure that all air bubbles are gone by using a toothpick. Next, I painted the cake pop in a Christmas red tone. Usually, I do that by choosing the right candy coating color, but I didn't have any red coating color at home. So I had to come up with a idea to make it more red and then I found this color at home and have never used it before and it it worked out totally fine and uh, you find all the colors in the description box below and the other materials as well and I completely covered the cake pop in red. Finally we are piping the peppermint effect on the cake pop that means we're putting a little bit of white candy melts or white candy wafers into a paper piping bag and by starting in the middle of the cake pop we drawing white sections and while they are still wet we add the glitter on top it really has to be wet otherwise it does not work out and if you have any parts that doesn't look too good to you you can use a brush and um, correct that afterwards and um, yeah and wor work your way through all of the sections so you have a nice peppermint look and yeah that's how it looks like Here we have it, peppermint candy cake pops. They go really well along with the other character of the winter cake pop set. So candy cones, thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, give it a like and leave a comment down below. I see you all in the next video and always remember, stay sweet and stay true. Bye!